All right, testing glow plugs. Uh, we've got a fault code on a Jeep Grand Cherokee, that thing there, uh, for one glow plug not um, being open circuit. So gonna run you through the testing procedures and the ways to confirm it, because we can't actually fault this right now. So we're gonna show you how to do it like properly. All right, so basically I've got a uh, black wire going straight to the ground, and this is the glow plug socket. Now, pretty much, you can do it on beat. Now, if you talk to any TAFE teacher, they don't want you to do it on beat. They want you to do it on an actual setting so you get a good reading, right? Because when you put it on beat, the slightest of a connection will actually make it beat. And see how that's reading a bit weird? We don't actually want that figure. So, we're gonna go there. So we're gonna get 0.7. So that's our first glow plug. And we'll go to our next one. And pretty close to 0 0.7, 0 0.7. Now this one goes to the intake manifold runner, which plugs in to there. So that's not actually a glow plug. We've got 0 0.7 on that one, 0 0.7 on that one, 0 0.7 on that one. So we're pretty good. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna run an amp test um, so we can see if the glow plug itself is failing or if it is that relay that's sending a code to the ECU. So we're gonna use this and yes, it's a super cheap auto one, but you know what? It does the job. So we wanna to go to 40 amps and we want to reset it to zero. Then we're gonna make our own circuit. So we've just got a fuse onto the positive terminal. Yes, it's a bit dodgy there, but we're gonna run that. And all we're gonna do is we're gonna clamp this around that line and I'm gonna stick it in each one and see what it does. So that one's drawing, started at 12, down to seven, go to the next one. Uh, next one. That's no good. So yeah, simple test. Now we've confirmed that every single glow plug works. So I'm pretty much gonna knock this relay and um, see how we go. But it should be pretty good.